city council meeting in San Jose over housing. The city is looking for sites to build emergency interim housing for the homeless. However, certain locations are getting lots of resistance from people who own homes around there now. Crown Force Justin Campbell outlines the situation. This is an extremely unaffordable city um, and we must support everyone in it and not just people who own $2.5 million homes. The site is especially inappropriate for EIH development as it is directly across the street from multiple schools. Furthermore, this is not just an empty lot. It is a park which is frequently used by our dogs, children, and neighbors. For hours Tuesday, multiple people used their two minutes of allotted time to voice their support or disagreement on where the city should house the unhoused. San Jose city leaders are considering to use VTA-owned sites to build tiny homes. The first proposed site is behind the Cerrone VTA yard in North San Jose. The second site is a parking lot at Cotto Road and Highway 85. It creates an equitable opportunity for unhoused, res unhoused residents in this area, such as the nearby Blossom Hill, uh, Cloverleaf, and Xander's Crossing, to gain access to a safe place to sleep in their own room while connecting to services. The council did not decide Tuesday on if the sites will be used. If approved, the city would have more than 900 tiny homes under construction for emergency housing. When you provide people with housing, it provides stability. Reporting in San Jose, Justin Campbell, Cron 4 News.